Hi, everybody. Um, I'm going to be looking up and down a little bit here and there as I made some notes <laughs> for this. Um, but, as you can tell from the title opening, I have a few gifts from some of you. How cool is that? <laughs> right? <laughs> so, um, I thought we would do like a box opening together. I have three different things. One box opening. Two of them I already opened. And actually, I just added just now, I found a super surprise gift. So stay tuned a little bit later in the video for that, okay? But first, if you're new here, my name is Scott. I'm originally from Chicago, and I live now in baden württemberg Germany. And the country, as you can hear the birds, and sometimes the church bells. <laughs> um, and I make these little videos about my life and my experiences here in this uh, sort of new life for me um, at my age is just I find it absolutely so cool all these new things that I can discover here in Germany so let's get into it to the gifts I'm actually really excited like this is like Christmas in the middle of uh, June right okay so the first one I got from a viewer um, by the name of Marcel um, didn't really write anything else on the package and just said just call him Marcel so Marcel this is awesome and here it is Kraft macaroni and cheese oh, you guys this is a big piece of my childhood second one first of all I have to take a break I'm gonna do the super surprise here because Shogaya, look what I found <laughs> in the back of my refrigerator behind some other Kimze beers. I found another one of the beers that you sent me. <laughs> well, like, I so I thought it was fitting to wear this. Oh, I'm so happy. There's one more of these beers left. Okay, ready for the best sound in the world? <laughs> so, prose to you all. Mmm. That hits the spot. It's a little bit warm today. On to the second one. I love these things so much. In the old days, you know, I used to say it's slap your mama good. There used there was some some commercial about it it's so good it's slap your mama good. Knuppers. How can you not love these? And I love the minis. Like I do this very European thing, right? I have my afternoon coffee and I have one of these. It's like two, three little bites, and you're done. It's got a perfect little weight. Even it's got a little arrow on the back telling you how to open it. But a long time ago, I mentioned that I love these things. And I got this request in an email. Um, please send me your, email, uh, your mailing address. It showed up just a box, or a bag of these mini knuppers. Well, about two weeks ago, this is all that's left, actually. <laughs> So another bag showed up. This is all that's left. Seriously, this is all that's left. Um, and I love these things. I absolutely love these things. Not with beer. It doesn't go well with beer, but they're fantastic. So it's really hot. Mm. <sighs> okay. So I had a little story to tell you about the Knuppers, right? Morgan's Hauptzain. I first learned of this um, in... Uh, the current job that I, well, I guess I was working. A friend of mine, Katya, she had those and she said, Ah, Morgan's Hauptzain. Hauptzain for English speakers means um, 9.30, half, half 10, half before 10. And I would always buy one of these, well, not always, I would buy one of these occasionally and bring it in and her and I would have this little thing in common that was sort of cool. But it does go really well, like 9.30 in the morning, you just want a little bit of something. You know, this would be about the time I'd have my second cup of coffee, maybe third cup of coffee, and then a little sugar boost. It's perfect, right? So, well, well. Um, but it's, for me, this is the perfect combination of milk, cream, a wafer thing, dings, booms in there. There's hazelnuts in there, and there's this chocolate cream in there as well. Um, and the bottom is covered with uh, a little bit of a hard chocolate, but I, I just think it's the perfect combination of cookie, milk, cream, chocolate, nuts, and the wafer. I, I don't know. 
for me it's ac absolutely perfect so um, this was the second gift the third gift the surprise gift was this that I couldn't wait to open because it's so hot here <laughs> so again bros but I received that one a long time ago I just just found that in the back of the fridge such a surprise that's cool okay now the third or actually fourth gift and I guess I felt so bad because they said oh I heard from DHL and DHL wrecked it it's completely destroyed and I thought oh no I said well don't worry about it it's a thought that counts that's fantastic I was gonna mention him in a video anyway saying thank you for that but he sent a replacement package and it showed up so this came from David David thank you so much this is so cool okay so Okay, oh my goodness. And a letter to go along with it. Okay, let's... As promised, here is some beer from a regional brewery. I'm very sorry this took so long. It's cool. I can't believe you did it again. <laughs> That's great. First things first, put those beers in the fridge. So we'll have to come back later. I'll film this first part, then I'll come back later and I'll, I'll, uh, I'll drink them at the end of this video, okay? As a goodie, because you had to wait for so long, I also packed some cookies. <gasps> Beer and cookies! Beer and cookies! Are you kidding me right now? That is so awesome! From Schulte Feingebach, which is a traditional which is a traditional confectionery and they produce right here in my hometown. Here are some of my favorites from the brand that you will find in this package. Ta-da! Oh, this looks like cookies. This looks like cookies. Yeah. Okay, cookies. Oh, man. I have seen something similar to this, but not this actual brand. Sot bitte. Schweins Ocean. Oh, pig's ears. <laughs> I get it. They look like little pig's ears. Wow, that is so awesome. Okay, we have to try those later, but since I'm drinking a beer, not now. Okay, second part. What else do we have here? Okay. <laughs> more. More cookies. Okay. Ooh. Now, wasn't I just talking about having knoppers as, as a coffee thing? This, to me, looks like a coffee cookie. Schulte Feingebach Biscuit Zungen. Extra zart und lecker mit zart bitter Schokolade. I think that's like dark, like bitter, dark chocolate, right? Which is good. But these look like something you could dip, right? Dip that right in your coffee. Wow. Oh, man. That is so cool. Okay. What else do we have in here? Okay, there's a box. Let's take this box out. Okay. A box. Now he has all kinds of um, instructions and things here, I think, or notes on what the beers are. But, like I said, first I'll, I'll, I'll film this part, come back, put these in the cool trunk, come back the refrigerator and come back and we'll jump taste that one. more cookies oh my gosh this is crazy dude Johannes Beere Tortchen I don't know if we have that thing in the US Johannes Beer, but I had a Johannes Beer soft absolutely delicious so now I'm really looking forward to these and and if my wife if you're watching this video these were addressed to me Hands off. Just kidding. But not really. Don't touch my cookies. Okay. And then we have two beers. Oh, mamma mia. Okay. Ooh. A Pilsner. Hoffenfelder Pilsner. Privat Brauerei. Fine Herber Premium Qualität. 
I gotta tell you, that bottle looks awesome. Okay, beer number one. Prost to you, Marcel, for the Kraft macaroni and cheese. And though, that person that wished you'd remain anonymous for the Knoppers, Shogaya for this beer, and David for all of these cookies and beer. I am absolutely flabbergasted. That's a great word, flabbergasted. Okay, here's another beer. Oh, another Pilsner, nice. So nice, you get to enjoy it twice. There's two more. We have two more boxes like this. Okay, two more beers. I can feel it. That is a beer. Okay. Hohenfelder Keller beer. Naturalich. Oh, there's something in the bottom of that. Oh, I don't know what that is. Naturalich Trube? Trube? Well, you guys will have to tell me what that means. I don't know what that means. Man, you did a great job of packing these, though. Look at that, Keller beer. Oh, two more beers, two more beers. <laughs> and two of the Hohenfelter Keller beer. Oh, so I got four of these. Obviously, there's something really good about that one if you sent four of them. Cool, that is so cool, man. I'll set these up and take a nice picture, and um, then I'll put these in the cool uh, truck. I keep saying, I speak Danglish now. Um, in the refrigerator in the cool trunk and I will come back and film them later but again this is about half gone I guess prost to you all and I'll see you in a little bit